so there's three different types of meditation that you speak about and it's sound breath and visualization so a lot of folks that may be finding your work which is actually one of the coolest things about your work is that you're you're bringing these principles to people far and wide far 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 and wide and so it could be a lot of folks that maybe have not identified as a meditator before and so when you speak of sound breath and visualization is there just a few tips that you could share or something that you want to talk to as it relates to developing that meditation practice I think one of the simplest things that I'd say for anyone who doesn't meditate and is just starting out is to create a few rituals with sight, scent, and sound that allow you to understand what it means and to be present with it. So I'll give an example. Uh, the first thing in the morning, 80% of us look at our phones first thing in the morning before we look at our partners or our children and the last thing at night after we see our partners and our children. And so the first thing you see in the morning is really, really important. How many of you know that when you look at the cloudy skies, that impacts your mind? If you look at news notifications and negativity, that impacts your mind? So if you start your day and you look at a prayer, a quote, a affirmation, and I know Gabby has these beautiful cards. Uh, imagine waking up and that's the first thing you see. That's going to fill your mind with the joy and the peace that you want rather than this pacey environment. So that's a, that's a meditation in and of itself, waking up reading an affirmation or a quote to yourself and just being present with it, even for 30 seconds. Like that is a beautiful way to start the practice of being present in meditation through sight. Scent is one of my favorite ones. Uh, there's a reason why we all feel calm and relaxed in a spa. And that's because they have sandalwood and eucalyptus and lavender. And so I really believe that if you're feeling anxious throughout the day, carry around a little essential oil, have a diffuser and just, breathe in for a second, just inhale the scent and you'll feel the scent do all the magical work. And that's beginning your process of meditation because it's making you present through scent. And then finally sound, uh, you know, as monks, we sound designed our life through nature sounds, whether it was water, whether it was natural birds, but you can recreate that today off a Spotify playlist or an Apple playlist, mm -hmm. whatever you want. And waking up or going to sleep, to the right vibrations and frequencies. That's how you meditate through sound. So just being, being present with sights, scents, and sounds is the beginning of meditation. And that's where I would start if I was you. And then the book obviously goes far deeper.